All right, this is gonna be a really short video. So this is my 1023E John Deere tractor uh, with the front end loader. So one of the things um, I noticed after I got this, and they recommend that you have a lot more weight in the back, um, ballast weight if you're lifting stuff. So I do a lot of work hauling material to try to fix up my road. So what I did is I took my existing box blade. This is what I bought from the dealer. It's the, um, I think it's the Frontier. There's the model number and I kind of oversprayed with the paint. But I had a cradle made that's welded onto my, my existing box blade. And then I went to a local company where they have these 50 gallon containers and I had them spin and melt a, um, the fill here instead of at the end. And then I had them put a hose bib on the bottom side and then I cut out uh, a gap so that um, it's not gonna hit anything. And then so I have the hose here if I want to drain it. So at eight pounds a gallon um, and 50 gallons, uh, that's what, 400 pounds? So that added 400 pounds. And this, of course, is really thick steel, so that added a bunch of weight. And you can see where it was welded, um, just welded against the existing frame and then have these extensions that come up and then support it. So by the time you add the box blade, 400, up to 400 pounds of water, and then I added um, water and some, um, I can't think of the word, um, environmentally friendly antifreeze to my tires. Um, I just haven't had an issue, so it's been great.